It is Monday morning, the 20th of June, the year 2022, and this is your friend Angus Bucken with a thought for the day. If we go to the book of Acts, Acts chapter 4 and verse 13. Now, when they saw the boldness of Peter and John and perceived that they were uneducated and untrained men, they marveled and then they realized that they had been with Jesus. There is no substitute for being with the Lord. You know, you can uh, go to Bible college. I wish I could have. I never had the privilege. You can learn to quote the Bible off by heart. That won't make any difference. Even a parrot can do that. What caused the religious leaders of the country of Israel to marvel at the apostles? It was their boldness. They realized that these men had actually been with Jesus. You see, you can learn all the theory, but that means nothing. Action always speaks louder than words. The chief priests and the elders of the church could not heal the lame man sitting at the gate beautiful outside the temple. He had been there from birth. But Peter and John did. That's right. They did it by faith, and they did it in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. That is what caused the leaders of Israel to marvel. One of my favorite scriptures in the Bible is Colossians chapter 1 and verse 27, which says, it is Christ in us that is the hope of glory. It's not us, it's Christ in us. Oh, my dear friend, you and I need to spend more time in the presence of of the Lord and not running to and fro all over the place trying to get counsel from people. I remember often when I was a young farmer, I would see an expert come from the university to tell the farmers how to do certain things. But these men knew the theory, but they didn't know the practical. For example, they couldn't start the tractor. And uh, <laughs> the students were waiting for him to start the tractor, but he didn't realize that there's a safety device in the tractor. And until you put the tractor into neutral, you can't start the engine. We need to roll up our sleeves and we need to get stuck in. We need to get to know Jesus personally and then go out and do exactly what he did. Jesus bless you and have a wonderful day. Goodbye.